for all the girls out there trying to love themselves in a world that's constantly telling them not to. Who taught you to hate the texture of your hair? Who taught you to hate the color of your skin to such an extent that you bleach to get like the white? Who taught you to hate the shape of your nose and the shape of your lips? Who taught you to hate yourself from the top of your head to the soles of your feet? You're she so flat. Get yourself a white mask. So you can have a flat for a black girl. You're, 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 you're too dark. You're too dark. You're ugly. You're, you're too dark. dark. They you're black you're, you're, you're ugly. ugly. She's, She's so ghetto. Your, your name is you're ugly. Ugly. You can't your hair like that. You can't you go out your house with your hair like that. Your name is you what? Black. Get yourself a white man so you can have cute black girl. Pretty. Or a black girl. The most disrespected person in America is the black woman. The most unprotected one, a person in America is the black woman. The most neglected person in America is the black woman. Dear unborn daughter, I'm writing you this letter because too often little black girls like you are not allowed to exist as you are and struggle to be deemed worthy of the space that they occupy. Because on the day you are born, you will be forced into a box that will leave you with no place to grow, and you will feel that you are inferior to the desires of this world. But you'll try your best to hide it. I know that your pillow will be soaked with tears and your throat full of sobs that you will never let escape. I know that it's hard. I know that it will hurt sometimes. Because I am bringing you into a world where for people like us, the road ain't so easy. So I wrote this for the day you come and tell me you want blue eyes. When you tell me you want good hair. When you tell me you're too dark, too light, or too curvy, your lips too big, your nose too wide, that you want to be a mixed girl, another girl, a better girl, anyone other than you are right now. Because one day you'll feel like you're not enough. So let me apologize now for all the times you don't want to look in the mirror, for all the times society says you have no place, for all the times you feel unpretty, for every time you're the butt of the joke, because of your hair or your style of dress, for all the crushes that will break your heart, the black boys who will tell you they don't date black girls but forgot they came out one, and the other ones who will love you in private and hate you in public. Too black to meet their mamas but just right to fulfill their negroidal fantasies. You won't understand why your black is baggage. You'll try so hard to fit in. You'll ask me why I was born this way. You'll ask me why must I live in this skin because you don't know queens were made to be above average. So let me apologize for every perm, every texturizer, every relaxer, every part of your soul that burns as you straighten your hair to hide your blackness because the world is so narrow-minded. Because to them, a black girl is a one-size-fits-all trope. But baby, don't be caged by the stereotypes. You are one of a kind. But I know the pain hurts more than scraped knees And six and stones melodies have lost their tone And it seems you can't escape the influence I promise one day you won't hate your hair I promise one day you won't feel unpretty I promise one day you will look in that mirror of yours and love your reflection You see what the world hates most is a black woman that truly loves herself And is not afraid to say it That's why they made it so hard for you to your black is beautiful and not baggage, and I want you to know that. So the things you are ashamed of are the very things you should be embracing, because they can't see your crown. They don't know that black girls are magic. Remember you are not finished. Remember that you are not even halfway finished on your journey to greatness. Know that the love you have for yourself will grow as your insecurities fade away. You are beautiful. You are worthy. You are everything you need to be. And when the world won't tell you that, I will. Love yourself, girl, and it will pay off. Love, Daddy.